Low flow oxygen devices, because they do not fully meet the patient's ventilatory demand, deliver variable oxygen percentages based on the oxygen flow rate, breathing pattern, and depth and rate of ventilation. The simple mask can be used when moderate levels of oxygen percentages within a range of 35 to 50 percent are required and must be run at a minimum of five liters per minute to wash out the patient's exhaled carbon dioxide. To administer a metered dose inhaler or MDI treatment, first shake the inhaler well and discharge a dose if it hasn't been used for 24 hours. A spacer device is preferred to maximize lung deposition. Next instruct the patient to exhale comfortably and place the spacer device between the lips, keeping the tongue down and relaxed. The patient should then take a slow, deep breath through their mouth and activate the MDI as they continue to breathe in until the lungs are full and then hold their breath for 8 to 10 seconds if possible. The patient should then exhale normally. Wait one to two minutes before taking the next puff in the same manner. Low flow oxygen devices, because they do not fully meet the patient's ventilatory demand, deliver variable oxygen percentages based on the oxygen flow rate, breathing pattern, and depth and rate of ventilation. The nasal cannula is the most common low flow device that can be run up to six liters per minute. It is convenient for the patient as they can eat and speak with the device on. The non-rebreather mask delivers the highest oxygen concentration of the low flow devices due to the oxygen reservoir and one-way valves that force the patient to breathe mainly from the oxygen-filled reservoir. The flow rate should be adjusted so the bag does not deflate more than one-third on maximum inspiration. A nebulizer actually forms an aerosol of the solution, thereby adding particulate water and giving much higher humidification levels. This device can also deliver varying percentages of oxygen concentrations. Large board tubing can be connected to an aerosol mask, trach mask, or face tent to be administered to the patient. A humidifier is used to add molecular humidity to dry gas, such as from an oxygen cylinder or coming from the wall outlet. It simply attaches to a flow meter and directs the gas through the sterile water solution to humidify the dry gas. Small bore oxygen tubing can then be attached, such as a nasal cannula, to deliver it to the patient. 